What's going on everyone? This is Smitty here talking about proper secondary decisions when it comes to either playing the receiver or playing the ball. Now what you guys are going to see here, I got the Lions going up against the uh, the Jags here. And you see the proper decision being made when he scrambles, when the they dove in for the sack. The defenders took each other out accordingly. But you see the positioning here by 42. He was behind the receiver. The ball was in favor of the receiver getting to it. So what he did was made the, the proper decision here, which was to play the receiver. What sense would it make for him to try and play the ball in this case? If he tried to play the ball, why would he come down with the catch? You see what I'm saying? Proper decision making here. So the ball is thrown where the receiver basically had the better chance of coming down with it. But when it comes to him making the play, he made the play on the receiver, and he tugged on that arm. Okay, he put two hands on it. He pulled on that arm there. Broke that pass up accordingly. And then you're going to see the wideout complain for a flag on that one. But clearly, you saw the DB watched it the whole time. He had his eyes on the ball, pulled that arm, and broke it up there accordingly. All right? Now, in this next play here, like the Bills, there's CPU, running it at full speed here so you guys can see. Initially, this was a great breakup that I saw right here. Both, and now in this case scenario, once again, due to the positioning of where the receiver and the DB was and then where the ball was thrown, they both had the chance to make the play on it. Now, of course, you saw the slight motion shift, and yes, we all know that's a problem. We're going to see that in all the games across the board. EA, they, you know, they got to get that rectified, no doubt, of course. We all know about that. But, nevertheless, you see how he came down with it. He had two hands on it. DB had the hand on it, and he popped it out like that at the last second. I mean, beautiful play right here. And I had to capture this. So these are things that we've never seen done before in any other football game. And I mean, but the key thing here, the main point here is making the proper decision when it comes to playing the ball or playing the receiver based on the position and where the ball is thrown. So let me know your guys' thoughts on this, and I'll be back with more vids. Tune in every Thursday night for Sim Standard Radio featuring myself, Sim F Ball Critic, and Azure Effect. The call-in number is listed there on screen, and the link to our show is in the description below.